Good morning, world. Good morning, internet friends. Good morning, everybody. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Anxiety when sleep is not your friend. We've been adding on to the list all day today. Good morning, internet friends. Or rather, good afternoon, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we doing, sassy girl? And then over here, there's Mr. Remorel sleeping. So, right now I am working on yesterday's vlog. Um, I finally found the name of the game Eli and I played. It's called the Whisper Challenge. Um, and that's going to be its own separate video because this vlog by itself, after some editing, is already like close to 13 minutes long and that would be such a long vlog, so decided to make it a different video. Plus, it's just a lot of fun. So, there you go. Um, so today there's not been too much going on. Um, I went with my parents and my brother to Kumo for lunch. And now Mom and Tyler are at Walmart, and Dad and I are at home. I'm up here working on the vlog, working on my fan fiction. And Dad is watching the Georgia-Alabama game? or I don't know who Georgia's playing. No clue. Um, so, it's kind of a chill Friday, and I'm happy with that. And I'm excited about getting my videos done, so, yeah. Happy Friday. So, just wanted to check in, tell you good morning, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey, guys! So, there's Mr. Emerell enjoying a bone, and the brat child, who is trying to steal the rawhide. He couldn't even finish the... He couldn't even have the rest of it because I had to hide it from Riddler. Because Riddler will take it. One, he could choke on the whole bone. Two, Rawhide messes with Riddler's stomach. He can't take it. He's fine with Rawhide. He is not. So, Riddler is annoying me because he's being a brat. Um, but anyway. I forgot to take my camera with me when I went and did this, but Emeril and I did some more car training and a little bit of leash training. He did pretty well. Oh, and we also got this in the mail today. It's our treat pouch. Yay! So whenever I'm training him, I can just, like, hook it to my belt and away we go. Um, so we were working in the car, working on car manners again. Mainly sit, stay, no matter what I'm doing. We did a little bit of leash training where I just walked him around some. Did sit, stay. Um, he wasn't too happy about that. He got really distracted because Dad let Riddler out, and Riddler, of course, kept messing with him. But I was so proud of him. A UPS truck came in front of our driveway, and he held a sit-stay while Dad was with the UPS guy. What are you doing? Riddler, you need to stop being a brat. Ah, nope, can't chew that. Finish the rest of your bone, because I know it's in your mouth. I know, I had to take the bone from you because your brother was a brat and wouldn't leave you alone. Yes, finish what's in your mouth first. Are you done with what's in your mouth? <sighs> Gotta love dogs. But anyway, so... I just wanted to share with you the wonderful moment of working on training with MRL and how much of a brat Riddler is, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys, so hopefully I don't get in trouble for copyright over this song that's playing. I really have no clue what the song is, um, but we're at Walmart. Yay! And let me go ahead and tell you, I'm at the most secluded corner I could find, because even though I've been vlogging for a year and even I've vlogged in public, all my public torture, it does not get easier. I still hate it. <laughs> So, today, this evening has not been that good. I uh, had a depressive episode over lack of confidence over cosplay stuff. And then, anxiety's kind of been eh. And now depression is just going like tanking. Just feeling like, I don't know, like I'm stupid and my cosplay suck and people hate me and just... A bunch of bullcrap that normally happens. Um, on the upside, I'm getting glue sticks to cover up my eyebrows so I can work on perfecting eyebrows better. And yes, you use glue to just glue the hairs down and then cover them up and away you go. 
So, yeah. That's my fun adventure in Walmart and in the mall. I just wanted to check in with you guys, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey, guys. So, I am back at home from our lovely adventure out. So, we got some Little Caesars, and we brought it home. Just finished eating, and now I'm running a bath so I can do a bath bomb. Because I'm not really feeling that great still. And I'm like, you know, why not? Like, I was talking with Caitlin, and she suggested maybe a bath bomb or a good fan fiction. I was like, you know, let's do a bath bomb, watch some YouTube, have myself a good old time, and then get out and probably work some more of my fan fiction. Because I'd like to get Chapter 2 out pretty soon. Hi, little boy. Hi. Mommy's going to take a bath in a minute. Would you like to join? You don't have to be in the bathtub, but you could play with some toys. Do you want to get a bone while we're in there? Or your reindeer? We could play with some toys together. Yeah, you'll like that. Say, so I smell the cookies. I want those. I have all of his cookies inside of his treat pouch. So say, I want those, Mommy. So, I'm going to go into the bathroom, work on filling up the bathtub, and have a good time, and I will check back in with you later. Hey guys, here's Emeril. Emeril's a silly goose. So, I'm just done with this night. Completely done with it. I am ready to just call it quits. I'll see you guys in the morning. Goodbye. So, if you're on my Instagram, or Emeril's Instagram rather, you've seen hashtag bath bomb adventure. Because that bath bomb... That bath was nowhere near relaxing. So, water got cold. And then, Emero was in there with me, like, in the bathroom. He was chewing on his toys. You know, no big deal. Everything was great. But then, I didn't know that the bathroom door was not completely closed. So, Riddler showed up. And pushed open the door. And he started play fighting with MRL, which was irritating. I tried to get comfy, I tried to relax, could not relax with the dogs. And then they were just play fighting to the point where I was just like, I can't even stay in here, so I have to get out. And they, he was even barking at MRL through the crack of a door. The Riddler doesn't know when to stop, sometimes. And then I had to go downstairs and watch a fire that my parents had lit while they went to pick up my brother. Which I wasn't too happy with. Because I'm already grumpy. Had not been feeling good all night. I got my essential oils on, just wanted to go to bed. So I was down there. And then the preface of episode went even farther. And I ended up trying what my therapist had suggested. And I gripped ice cubes in both of my hands because I was having certain urges. That worked. The ice cubes, they work. They sting so bad. And you're supposed to grip them for as long as you can. And I know in therapy, I gripped them longer. But oh my gosh, these hurt. So by the time I released them, my palms were white. But it worked. I didn't have the urges anymore, but I still felt like crap. And then once I finally got the boys to quit play fighting... And I had each of them playing with their own toys. So I was getting annoyed with Riddler stealing one of MRL's toys that's easy to tear apart. And I finally got it to where MRL was playing with his toy. And Riddler was playing with another toy. So. Now I'm finally back in my room. I've got Little Man to myself. I don't have Riddler or Sassy in here. And honestly I don't want to. I'm so tired. My head hurts. I'm just very grouchy, irritated. I notice I get irritated at Riddler a lot. And I mean, I love him. I really do. And I have to remember that he's also a baby still. It's just really, really annoying. That he keeps constantly messing with Emeril. 
And it also works if we're trying to train or if I'm trying to get a little bit to go potty. And Riddler will try to play with him. And will be distracting. Um, so if you guys have any tips on what I could do about Riddler, then please comment them down below. And no, do not say get rid of Riddler. I could not do that. And my dad would kill me. So. Yeah. My mood is just not good. I'm not happy. So, I'm going to see if some sleep will help. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. And I hope it was better than my night. So, question of the day is when you are just feeling really grouchy and irritated, what do you do to make yourself feel better? I honestly have no clue. I don't know what I'll do. I just calm down eventually. Put your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night, Emeril. Good night, baby.